Hello, Katie. It is 12.06 in the morning, and you... I just watched the video that you posted. It's the 8th, technically, of February 2013. And I really shouldn't be making this video right now. I should be in bed, but I'm not. And the reason I should be in bed is because tomorrow I'm going to look at their, like, on-campus apartments. Um... Kirkland and Newhall, and I'm going with two other girls in the morning to go look at them, possibly see about signing up to get one, which could be fun, because it's a lot nicer than the dorms. And I would totally move the camera around to just to emphasize my crappy room, but I'm not really wearing pants, so yeah. This is where the camera stays. I love how my head is strategically big enough to cover my lack of pantalones. Because I have a big head like that. But not big enough for the Mad Hatter's hat, apparently. As you know. Which sucks and it hurts me deep. So, I don't know if you saw my Facebook status, but I feel like Tumblr is slowly destroying all of my social skills. I was in class, and it was Spanish. And I had my tab, which is somewhere hidden from me, because it does not wish to be found. And my picture of my spider solitaire background is Jensen Atlas, and he looks very cute. And the guy next to me, he like, he like kind of, um, damn, what's the word? Um, he just kind of like nudged, nudged my arm a little bit to get my attention because I had my headphones in because I'm antisocial like that. And he's like, so do you, you must watch Supernatural. And I'm like, yeah, I really like that show. And then he's like, it's good. And I just went back to playing Spider Solitaire for whatever reason. I, it didn't occur to me until like five minutes later when it was too late. He might have been trying to actually have a conversation with me. Which sucks because he was really cute. And I just, my mind froze up and it's like, yep, you're not going to function today. Which is awesome. So, in other news... I may be possibly, very slightly possibly, like, it's it's going to take some doing to happen. Um, I might be going to Florida for spring break, so that'll be fun. I'll be going to see my grandparents and staying with them. And I may or may not see Brittany because right now she's MIA. She got mad because Granny and Gramps are like, yeah, Chris needs to go back to Georgia. Because he had been there for almost a month, which means that he doesn't have an actual job. He's not trying to find one. So, there, Gramps is like, he needs to be gone. And a couple days later, Brittany came to Gramps and told him in a not-so-happy way that, yeah, Chris will be gone by Tuesday. And after Chris left, Brittany left too. And I talked to my grandparents, and they're like, yeah, we haven't seen her since Tuesday. And I'm like... That was two days ago, and she hasn't, like, texted or called or anything to check in and say, Hey, I'm still alive. Not locked in a van somewhere. Or maybe in the basement of someone that we may do or do not know. And I hope that she's okay, but she never answers texts. Not really. Um, I have no clue how I got on the subject of talking about Brittany. Oh, Florida. Um, so yeah, if I do go, I'm really looking forward to that because I am going to try and get tan because I kind of, I only look a little darker than my t-shirt because it's white and it's even not that much darker than it, so I seriously need some sunlight. I am not a Minnesota person. I can't deal with the snow. Anyways, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Not a whole heck of a lot going on, besides I am completely caught up with Once Upon a Time, and you need to catch up too, because I am so bursting to tell, to talk about what happened in the episode that I watched. I was just so devastated. So, even if you just watch like the last 30 seconds of the 11th episode, you, you, that that will work. You won't know what led to the events, but it'll work, and we can talk about it. So yeah, that's my video, and I just hope that you have a good weekend, and I'll see you soon. Bye!